In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys my personal Apex Legends settings for PC, PS4, and Xbox One. Hey, what's going on guys? You're Anime Otaku and welcome back to another video here on the channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys what settings I use to play Apex Legends on my PC while I'm using my mouse and keyboard, PS4 controller, and Xbox One controller. I do own all three items right here and I feel like many of you would have many questions of what kind of settings you should use use for apex legends and this goes out to many people that do play the game and still have a hard time trying to figure out their comfort zone of playing apex legends because they don't know the type of controls that they should use and it took me quite a long time and plus the fact that i did take a break from apex legends towards like maybe the middle or end of season three and then skipped out on season four because i just had it with the game and then when season five came out i came back and i'm just having a blast I, I feel like i'm having as much fun as i did back in like season one when i played for the first time here we are i'm going to be showing you guys what my settings are for pc so this is mainly going to be on pc i know that many of you have console so basically this can convert into console gaming as well because the ui and the settings are very similar or maybe even exact i do own a ps4 i played apex legends on ps4 and i can tell you that my experience with that is very similar it's just the difference with the frame rate that's it um, other than that it's a very similar experience so let's get to it shall we okay so here we are at the settings I'm gonna be going through each one of these tabs just so you guys could get a feel of what I play with and you can convert it into your own personal preference interact prompt style I went with default button hints keep that on I usually do forget my keybinds whether it be on controller or PC so I do like to leave that on crosshair damage feedback I like to leave it at X with shield icon damage numbers I like to do stacking ping opacity I put that on faded obituaries i have that on mini map rotation on weapon auto cycling on empty that's actually a personal preference just gonna stick with on just because i do run out of ammo and i forget to switch my weapons auto sprint is another personal preference i like to keep that off so i could have full control of my character double tap sprint off incoming damage feedback i set that to 3d taking damage closes death box menu turn that off now accessibility it's all personal preference at this point Point, there's no right or wrong here none of this i'm going to be showing you is right or wrong it's just personal preference now some keyboard i'm not going to go through all the key binds here the most important thing here is the sensitivity of your mouse i'm not really confident with my stuff yet but what i can say the most often used sensitivity that i use is between 2.3 to 2.5 and i put it at 2.5 ads mouse sensitivity i've done a lot of things with this i have to keep it at the same sensitivity throughout the entire gameplay so I kept it at a one mouse acceleration never turn that on mouse invert nope lighting effects now that depends on your hardware of your mouse and keyboard and all that keep that off now let's get on to controller now these settings I believe are really good for both ps4 and Xbox together so button layout keep it at default next stick layout default interact slash reload button just use tap to use and reload crouch button toggle aim button hold trigger dead zones i have none menu cursor speed now i would recommend keeping this below half maybe even uh below a third look sensitivity i put that at six next look sensitivity ads i keep that at five you want it lower than your actual look sensitivity to be honest because it all depends on where you're aiming and how you're aiming and all that response curve you don't want to be any more higher than steady next look dead zone keep it at none movement dead zone keep that at small invert look never vibration now that's personal preference i prefer vibration next i'm basically going to be showing you guys some gameplay of me playing with the pc ps4 controller and xbox one controller
Nice. You have a gold. Nice try, bro. help out for once again I can't. 